Well, we have the pleasure of having Charlie Abrego here from Gladys Porter Zoo with our zoo guest of the week, Ferdinand. Little Ferdinand, not so little Ferdinand. <laughs> so How little, old yeah. is this guy here? Well, he's uh, he's about maybe uh, five or six years old, somewhere around there. He's a bull snake, which can be found here in South Texas. And um, and like I was mentioning earlier, he can get a little bit bigger than what he is right now. So believe it or not, you know, the, but they're non-venomous snakes. Um, these bull snakes are actually, um, you can find them here in South Texas. And one of the things that people are, are kind of afraid of them is because they look like a rattlesnake. Right. And that's kind of like for their protection, you know, because they kind of mimic that coloration, well, you know, there's already on them. And so people generally, or animals or predators in, in a sense, um, generally stay away from them. Right. Because they can hiss and make certain noises and they shake their tail and um, on like on leaves or on the ground. So it kind of sounds like if it's a... Uh, uh, it could possibly be rattlesnake, so it's kind of like a... Mm -hmm. In other words, Ferdinand is a very smart guy. He's a very <laughs> smart uh, snake, yes, yes. He can, really, he can really get out of trouble. And at the zoo, we have, I think, four bull snakes. We have some in the herbitarium, which is the reptile house, and then we have um, two in the education department, and those go off to schools. The other one's not as nice as Ferdinand, <laughs> but, but um, it's still, we're still working with that other one so we can get it out to um, maybe some schools or other special events. And it's so beautiful. It's skin. I promise this is as much as I'll do because <laughs> I'm too scared to put Ferdinand around my hands. Yeah. Charlie here is a brave man. <laughs> but one of the, like you were talking about touching, one of the interesting things about they have almost three different scale textures. The one oh, on the top wow. is a lot rough and the side a little bit smoother. And of course, the ones on their um, bottom half, uh, they, they uh, are a lot wider and smoother. So, you know, they can get around. Well, lots of fun friends like Ferdinand will mm -hmm. be present this upcoming Saturday. You have an awesome event coming up. So, yeah, so our, it's our annual fundraiser, our biggest fundraiser of the year. Zufari actually um, is going to be this Saturday. If you want more information, you can go onto our Facebook or gpz.org, which is our website, or call us at 546-7187, and you can get all this information about the event. It's pretty much a gala, and it's a fundraiser for the event. And it's been fundraiser. going on for some time. Yes. It's what can people expect if they come? So before in the 80s it was called the zoo ball and so it's it's a nice uh, event there's music there's a sit-down dinner um, there's a, a silent auction and then there's a big live auction with a lot of amazing like one of the pri one of the things you can bid on is a trip for Africa for five days okay. so it's kind of incredible you know if you were to secure that you know of course it might be a little bit pricey mm -hmm. but but um <laughs> but yeah. worth it but worth it i'm sure yes awesome thanks charlie and yeah. thank you ferdinand my friend